Hello. Recently I made a silly video about some cushions that I have and I had a lot of questions about where to buy them. So I thought I'd make this video because it turns out the two websites I mentioned at the time are, have actually started selling these bathrobe boys. So I thought I'd do a little video to show you the quality of the items, also the size, and then show you how easy it is to buy from the websites. So let's start with the cushions. Uh, what you order is actually uh, the cushion case, not not the cushion itself. I bought this off Amazon. I bought two of these off Amazon. Uh, this is the case. It will arrive folded up like this and in a in a film bag. And yes, it is 100% polyester. It's not as soft as cotton, but then you want it robust if you're going to be you know, hugging it. The zip seems quite sturdy and it finishes nicely off. I don't actually have bathrobe boy chibi cushions, however, I do have cat butler ones and I've checked the dimensions and they are the same. They're quite puffy. They seem to put that on the back of most things. Actually, I didn't show you, did I? I missed showing you actually the back of these. So the chibi cushions, they're, they're quite squishy. Uh, they come flat packed, actually folded in half, and the air is completely sucked out of them uh, for transport. Uh, you just need to throw them in the dryer on a cool setting for a few minutes and they'll puff right up. These are lovely to cuddle. Now we also have uh, A4 file sleeves. They're quite nice. I got these because they show off the whole artwork uh, and these are relatively cheap and also they're files. I mean, they're very useful. That's those on the back. I don't know how long they'll last if I use them. I don't know how robust these are, but they're quite sweet. Also, if this video has been useful so far, please do give it a thumbs up so I know to make more like this. If you're looking at, at the Obey Me merch, you, you may see something called a bromide. It's quite floppy. It's basically a photo print. In the Bathroom Boys section, there are some acrylic cards. Now, the size of the cards are similar to the trading cards that they came out with. Now, these are just card. Um, and the ones on sale with the Bathroom Boys acrylic so they'll be thicker they'll be good quality these are just um card but that's the right size it's about the size of a credit card out of interest i've done the unboxing of these so i'm just editing it if you want to be notified when that comes out you can subscribe and hit the bell the official acrylic items are actually really sturdy quite thick it does depend of course what style you get as to what size it is even the small ones are so cute and, and and really well made so this is the mirror it's got nice artwork it's really sturdy that isn't a sticker that feels like it's it's printed on it's not embossed or anything i think that's actually printed on it's just a mirror And the other thing we have are can badges. Now again, these are the Cat Butler Boys. But I'm just showing you the quality of these. It's a good big, it's a good size. I mean, that's, I guess you would, people would pin this to their bags. Personally, I like to put magnets on the inside of drawers because they're metal, have them magnetized on display. That covers most of the things that I have. So here are two boxes from AmiAmi. One of them was delivered by DHL and the other one was shipped using surface mail. The surface mail is about half the price. Now this on the right is the one that came surface mail and it looks fine. It's slightly bushed, but not really. It's fine. And I can tell you the contents were safe. However, it can take up to three months. This took 
such a long time that I actually wondered if it was going to arrive at all. I wanted to show it to you to prove that surface mail does work. However, some companies, not AmiAmi, but other companies have mentioned that perhaps there can be damages uh, if you go surface mail. I definitely haven't had any problems uh, from like DHL delivering items. AmiAmi does have um, a bit of a loading problem sometimes if there's a lot of traffic. AmiAmi was really easy to set up an account. I haven't had any problems with them. Animate International, like I say, I haven't used but they seem it seems like quite a straightforward website for some reason anime international is slightly cheaper than amiami but it's negligible really if this video was helpful please give it a thumbs up so i know to make more like this that's it cuddles for everyone jamata <laughs>